Oh, dude, it's time for another beer review. For this one, we're going back to Sainsbury's, and it's a beer from Tiny Rebel Out of Wales, and it is Equaliser IPA. They call it, here's the IPA, 5.8% in the 500 ml can. I reviewed recently the Milk Stout from Badger. I thought it was okay. I've had a few more of the new Sainsbury's beers, and I've got to be honest, I don't think they're great. I think they're very, very... Poor to average. I had Fruzy from Tiny Rebel. I wasn't keen on that. I reviewed. I, had, I didn't review them. I just had them all on the weekend when I was watching the Champions League final. Um, I had Fruzy Tiny Rebel. I wasn't really impressed with that. I had the Guelo peanut butter raspberry. I wasn't keen on that. I had the Double IPA from Buxton. I wasn't keen on that. Um, so I don't think the recent drops been that good. And from what I've had so far, so I'm hoping. This one's going to be one of the better ones, but um, yeah, just a bit bit underwhelmed with what's been in Sainsbury's of late, to be honest. But hopefully this one's good. So it says on the back of the can, on the eye, hazy, on the nose, juicy, and on the taste, pine, forward slash tropical. So um, they're not giving a lot away. Um, Tiny Rebel, I've got, I, I like to, I feel like I slam Tiny Rebel's notes sometimes what they describe on the cans because um, sometimes with the flavours and what's on the nose, they either say what it smells or tastes like or they're very, very vague. Um, so, and I worry when it's like that. So, um, when it's vague, that is. So that, that is hazy. I will give them that that is hazy. Um, there's, there's no light getting through that at all. Um, golden orange colour. It's got a foamy white head. Is it going to hang around? I'm not sure. I'll get the nose. It's just, yeah, I can see why they're saying juicy because there isn't really a fruit that's coming out. Um, if I was having to be really, really nearly my colours to the mast, I'd say it was orange. Or maybe you touch a line, but they're not. It's just just like generic fruit aroma really right i'll dive in cheers everybody yeah the pine's there um and then you're getting this orange lime and lemon kind of hybrid flavour up front. I don't think it's a big pine flavour. I think it's subtle. Um, I think it's more of a, a juicy juicy beer rather than a, than a, a pine bitter beer. But there is a subtle note of it on the, on the aftertaste. I think it's all right. I don't think it's too bad. Um, a few people I know have had it. Um, it's been hitting me. Some people really like it. Some people don't. I'm okay with it. Compared to some of the other new beers that are in Sainsbury's, this is one of the better ones. I would much rather drink this. And as I'm talking, now that bitterness is starting to come out. I'm starting to, to taste it. You have to taste um, Yeah, um, Yeah, it's better than the Guelo one. It's better than the other Tiny Rebel one. I'm enjoying it more than the Stout that I reviewed. So... It's it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, I paid two pound forty for it, so I certainly don't feel like I've been fleeced. For the for the price, it's good for the price. So um, yeah, I just think some of the super. I mean, I can't comment on the Morrison's beers because I haven't had them. The new ones that have came out because my local Morrison's is crap. But um, some of the supermarket offerings that I've had of late haven't been as good as they were say two years ago. I don't know if that's margins. I don't know if that's due to, like, we've pushed it as far as we can and with the cost of living crisis, I, I, I really don't know. But um, I just, I've been a little bit underwhelmed with the supermarkets of late with the new offerings and I totally get that you need to refresh to, to get interested and people like me who just drink the occasional beer in the supermarkets to uh, to come back in. But, um, yeah, I'm. Uh, it's all right. It's all right. Um, would I buy it again? I would consider it in Sainsbury's versus some of the other options is probably what I would say. But I wouldn't, if I, if I was like, oh, I've got to go to the supermarket and buy a beer, I wouldn't rush to Sainsbury's to buy it. But if I was in Sainsbury's, based on some of the new 
new things that are in there, I probably would pick it. That's not to say it's amazing, but it's better than a lot of the average beer that's in there. So it's it's all right. It's all right. It's it's solid. It's safe. I reckon if I had this five years ago, I'd have said it was amazing. But um, it's all right. So that's Equalizer IPA from Tiny Rebel. Thank you for watching and on to the next one. Cheers.